Hello everyone, uh, this is Scotty Treehouse again and uh, today I just want to review this uh, set of uh, jewelry pliers that I got from Amazon uh, just got it today and I just wanted to show you how everything works and uh, do a quick review uh, this is the set, I think it was about $19 or so and the reason I got it was because I wanted it uh, something that I could work with on a small electronics uh, when I need to grip st small stuff and uh, these had a lot of the needle nose pliers that I wanted so that's why I ended up getting this one let's see it's supposed to have uh, rubberized <coughs> grips and I hope hoping it'll be comfortable to use but this is what it looks like um, you can see a close-up of it the finish seems okay I don't see any oils on it or anything like that uh, I wonder if I can use my magnifying glass to show uh, I've never tried it before but let's see let's see if it works so uh, hmm, interesting this is uh, what it looks like Let me see. Let's check out my video camera. Will it work like this better? Interesting. Uh, maybe I'll we'll get a macro lens one day. So this is without it. This is with it. Here's the other tool. If I get closer. This is the cutting one. I do have a macro lens for my camera, my phone, so maybe I'll try that next time. Just to play around with. I wonder if I can hook this to my table. Uh, so these are the set. I think that for me, I think this one might be useful later on when I need to grip stuff. But uh, let's test it out. Maybe let's test some uh, cutting of these uh, wires. Let me see how much force it has. Uh, seems okay. It does take a lot of effort. There's no uh, force multiplier, that's for sure. And uh, let's say I want to cut the... the wrap hopefully this is clear try cutting this pretty clean cut uh, let's try to wrap this, maybe? Do a wrap? Uh, it works. Hmm, doesn't have a good grip. Like, I, I, I'm tightening it, trying to pull it, but it doesn't, uh, doesn't hold it very well so can't really use it for anything uh, that you want to put a lot of strength on so it's kind of weak because of the length maybe this one's better let's see yeah this one's a lot stronger I can't just pull it apart so easily here's the uh, the jaws of it it's okay See how the cut works. Yeah, works fine. So I mean, it's uh, fairly cheap. I mean, it hasn't. I think cutting the wires it didn't scratch it yet. Hmm. 
Wow, this one's kind of useless. Can't really do much with this one at all. It takes so much force. Wow, it almost hurts the hand. Yeah, this one's kind of useless. This is probably the weakest tool of the whole bunch. It's got some uh, retraction. I mean, so you can uh, close it and it's gonna automatically expand it back out. Ugh. These two are probably the weakest tools. These two right here. This one, hopefully, let's see. If I grip it, it's just gonna hold. No, you can pull it apart. Okay, it's not too bad, but there's no jaws on this thing. As you can see, it's pretty flat. Uh, this is a, uh, I mean, it's okay. It could slide off pretty easily, as you can see. So, uh, it's cheap. Not the greatest. This one's flat. bad I guess I'll provide a link uh, if you're interested in buying it below and uh, would appreciate it also if you could subscribe and help out help my channel grow thank you so much bye